so hey guys welcome back once again and in today's video i'm just gonna talk about 4x ultra sharp workflow or as you can say an upscaling workflow on confi UI. remember guys olivio has made a video about an ultra sharp upscale on automatic 1111 and this workflow is just similar to that and just this is a confi ui you can check out the video it's an amazing detailed video by olivio and yes in this i'm just going with the same workflow on confi ui as you can see guys there are total three sections going on over here first of all you can see this is a text to image section going on the second thing and this is a latent high res fix workflow going on over here and the last thing over here is ultra sharp basically ultra sharp is an ultra sharp upscaling model you can use an amazing model that has launched you can download this model over here on model.yk there are so many upscaling models going on and after you download and if you want to paste it on confi ui let me tell you guys where to paste it so as you can see i'm already on confi ui directory you can go on confi ui over here and on confi ui you can go on models and on models you can see upscale models so here you can see i have already pasted some of the upscaler models just like 4x ultra sharp over here and 4x nmkd as well so here you can paste the model and yeah there are so many models going on this website let me tell you guys why this workflow is very important in order to get you details you can say that you can directly upscale this image as well and get the details but no guys you need latent high res fix as well the reason to this i will explain you in detail before that let me explain you what i was using you can see over here i was using realistic vision model epic noise offset lora as well i was using epic noise offset lora as well this is positive prompt this is negative prompt this is with an height of the text to image and on over here i was using all our ancestral and denoising 1.0 denoising strength and yes that's the basic thing that i was using and this was the text to image result and then this output this is a basic text to image output i was sending it to latent high res fix and in this latest high res fix you can see i was just multiplying it by 2 basically uh, on text to image i got 512 by 512 and this is you can see this is 1024 by 1024 multiplied by 2 and this is the result that i got you can see over here denoising you can mess around with denoising strength as well 0 0.50 denoising strength on latent high res fix will uh, definitely get amazing details over here and then this image into an upscaling workflow so on upscaling workflow you can see uh, i was just upscaling it by multiplied 2 like 1024 into 1024 multiplied by 2 you can get 2048 resolution by 2048 so basically i'm just multiplying by 2 on both of the upscalers just like over here multiplied by 2 and this over here multiplied by 2 now guys if i show you the result look at this on extreme left is a basic text to image result and on middle this result is a latent high fix result and on the right is an upscaling result 4x ultra sharp upscaling result now let me tell you why these three steps first of all you can see on basics text to image look at the details over here there is something like uh, it messed with the face as well not a lot of details yes definitely something going on on the face as well and so in order to fix this latent high res fix is used and you can see on this image on the middle section this is basically a latent high res fix image what latent high res fix does is that it will try to read out your image and try to fix and add more details to your image the details from the face are gone and yes we got an amazing result over here definitely an amazing and outstanding result great result as well you can say in short it tried to fix out and add more details to the image that's why latent high res fix is used guys so this is the reason the latent high res fix is used and what about if you want to add more details just like add an extra resolution to it just if you want to upscale this image i can upscale this image as well you can upscale this image as well and get the details but what happens if you go on upscaling directly text to image result you will definitely not fix this on the face as well just like you will get this upscale result directly on the final result so that's why in order to fix this latent high res fix the second step is used and then in order to upscale this image into a detailed image let me show you guys you will get shocked right now look at these details details over here on the face it's literally amazing you can see let me show you all the three faces closely look at this this is a text to image this is image to image now look at this really amazing i just love this uh, workflow amazing amazing workflow so what do you think about this thing guys isn't it amazing just in order to get more details into image this workflow is very very amazing now let's generate one more result so guys as you can see these are the result that i got this time and 
yes one more thing that i loved about confi ui is that you just need to click once and yes all of the result will generate automatically you just don't need to go and adding on different different steps one click and that's all you need to do and it will just work like a wonder and now let's check on to the result closely i have generated two result i will show you both of the result just now let's check on the results guys so now guys as you can see these are the result that i got on extreme left definitely you can see this is the result that i got on basic text to image not a lot of deformation but still this is an amazing result and on middle section definitely this is a latent high res fix result amazing result over here as well there are a lot of details going on on the eyes lot of details going on you can see on the neck as well there are a lot of details going on you can definitely see so basically it will try to add more details to your image there are chances that it will change your images as well but you will get an amazing result on the latent high res fix and then if you look closely on to the upscale result definitely definitely amazing result i just love this result just look at the face over here i just love this result look at the hairs over here oh my god it's really interesting just look at the details <laughs> oh my god pretty 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 amazing and yes definitely i just love the details with the 4x ultra sharp and if i show you the next result as well i generated two result so as you can see this was the result the second result that i got and definitely uh, this time as well uh, not a lot of deformation on the face going on but yes there are a lot of dots going on but in this image you can see on latent high res fake yes amazing result and some hairs also added on the face you can definitely see look closely on the hairs you can call it like facial hairs and now if i show you the upscale result as well look at this guys look at this just look at look closely over here on this face and look closely on this face as well just like uh, details on the wrinkles as well look at the hairs guys look at this <laughs> oh, pretty pretty interesting i just love this result on 4x ultra sharp upscale model isn't it interesting that you can go and work with this workflow you can download this workflow from my discord server i have uploaded this workflow on my discord server as well 4x ultra sharp upscale and this workflow is literally amazing so you can go and work around with this workflow guys so that's the only thing that i wanted to explain you guys and yes i will be back with more and more videos tomorrow till then have a good day bye guys love you all guys bye guys